I'd say the kind of art style Eris has is very reminiscent of old the old games we used to play as children. Eris is retro. It's a retro platformer. It's uh, bright and it is funky fresh. If I were to see Eris in any other type of art style or even in 3D, I feel like no one would really understand sort of the look or the type of feel that people would get if they wanted to play the game. The art style of Eris is really like a really simple style. It's not too detailed. Our main character is a little girl who we call Kevin. Kevin is little and it's pretty simple. She has a brown hood, a blue dress, and a wonderfully dark attitude. I think pixel art suits Eris because it's a cute idea. It really brings out the character of the little girl. When Kevin jumps, the hood just kind of billows and it's so cute. When I create an asset, I generally just try and conceptualize it. So I try to sketch it out, see what I can come up with, maybe 10 to at least 30 thumbnails or just little drawings of it. You know, just some simple sketches. And then we put them as pixel art and we went through all these different stages of do we like this, do we not like this, what color should this be? And then we would send them off to our animators, MJ and Sean, and they, you know, made made it come to life. When I receive the asset from the artists, I usually receive it as a, a plane, so it's not taken apart, so I have to play like a little surgeon, take everything like limb by limb, and then start frame by frame. My favorite character, art-wise, my favorite asset. My favorite is a lantern wielder. His death is <laughs> was fun. <laughs> it just the whole light dimming and then him fading away. I think I have to go with Kevin. I think Kevin's my favorite. My favorite asset would probably either have to be the well or the cart. Not only do they look like what they're supposed to look like, but I find that they will be able to really pop out very well in the game. I'm excited to watch other people play it and see what they think and just watch you know, the characters that, that we designed moving around and coming to life, you know? I'm excited to see them all together. Um, I, I want to see how players interact with them and how everything looks. If I can just see uh, the smile on their faces or see uh, if just how they can figure out some of the levels or even just look at the game and admire the look of it, I think that would be wonderful.